So I was asked to do an old school whiteboard shenanigans that I used to do. Um, you know, we haven't really done that since like 2017, 2018, maybe even earlier or later. It should be now 2016. Um, you know, one of the biggest things we used to look at is movement standards. You guys have them all on online uh, through uh, CrossFit. And then you have all kinds of tips and tricks of placing the dumbbell closer on one side. So that way you're not crossing your body. You have the step your leg on the outside shenanigans, which is smart. Um, hop up, hop back, whatever, you know, the reality of it is that you want to keep your burpee the same. Um, the other thing you want to know is that if you started out hot and you're like, Oh, Hey, you know, I started too hot and I blew up, I blew up. Well, the question becomes is what was hot, right? Like if you, if you look down line and you're seeing these guys, uh, Noah or Chandler or other guys that are going sub six minutes, uh, they're coming out hot. They're coming out hot. So let's understand that you're going to need like a 40 second burpee and you're going to need or a 40 second snatch and maybe a 45 second, 50 second burpee, which in turn is getting you like 130 or three minutes for the 21s, which is hot, like on fire, like you're taking clothes off. You're so hot. Um, and looking at that, but that being said, you know, I was asked like, Hey, what about the splits? What about the times and, and all that? And I was like, well, you know, I haven't really done that in a while, nor do I think I want to. And here we are now modern whiteboard, modern setup, modern idea here. So, uh, let's, let's get into this thing. Right. So, uh, the workout, I should, I should write it all fucked up like Dave Castro did with like the 21 and then a 15 and then the nine and then go back to maybe, maybe, baby, and then keep going back and forth with this maybe, maybe, uh, which at one point I was like, oh shit, is this guy going to give us 180 reps of burpees just to start out the fucking open? That would have been, now that would have been hot. That would have been a problem. That would have been real. That would have been losing half of uh, the open right out week one, which would have been very classic, classic uh, CrossFit style. But let's look at it, right? So we got 21, 21, 21, 21. Then we got 15, 15, 15, 15. Oh, shit. Why well, can't even draw a 15, 15. And then I got a nine. I was getting excited there. Nine, nine, nine. So if we look at this and we're like, all right, cool. This is the breakdown. Here we are. I'm looking at it. I'm looking as I go. What am I going to do with my splits? How am I going to break this down? Where am I going to take this bad boy? I'm going to look at it and I'm going to be like, all right, well, you know, 21 dumbbell snatches is going to take me roughly 40 to 60 seconds depending on what kind of speed you got, how that's going to go, what's your overall objective here and where you want to go. Because if I go two minutes, two minutes, that gives me four minutes. If I go 130, 130, that gives me three minutes, which is at now I'm at seven minutes already. So I'm already out. I'm already outside of what we know is hot right? Which is competitive at a very high level. Um, and then now if I look at it and I go one minute, one minute, that puts me at another two minutes here, which in turn gives me a sub nine minute time, right? Well, we already know that, okay, that's great. That's awesome. But what does it look like if I wanted to go faster than this? Well, that was where you start looking at these. Okay. Well, if I go 130 and I go 130, then that's gonna put me at the three minute mark. If I go 115 or even one minute, one minute, which is gonna be like 115, but 110, I don't know, somewhere around there. That puts me at a two minute mark, which puts me at five minutes in general. And then if I go 30 seconds, 30 seconds, well, hello, hello, that's one minute. That's sub six minutes. So there, there's your breakdown already. So if you're looking at how do I get to a split of that I get under six minutes, I'm looking at somewhere around, you know, whether I share the dumbbell, 
if I'm saying, okay, the nine dumbbells take me 10 seconds and nine burpees take me 20 seconds, either way I share it, that's where my split comes from, you know, and then knowing transition times and all that other stuff. So that's, that's how I look at my capability of making it through this. Now, if I'm looking back and I'm like, oh shit, you know, I took 11 minutes or I took 10 minutes and I really did move slow. It wasn't very painful. I finished it. I wasn't hot. I feel like, you know, it was really, really kind of uh, took some smoke breaks in that process. Very European, like where where can I kind of speed this bad boy up? I can look at my rep speed, rep speed on the dumbbell. The other one that I can look at is my my speed or the lack, the loss of speed on my burpee. So where did I slow down my burpee, right? So which is probably somewhere around here on this 15 or somewhere around this 15. I lost some speed, some mustard on the burpee and I'll give you I'll give you some, uh, do I have, no, I don't have yellow. I gotta get, I gotta get some yellow here. I don't have yellow. It's green mustard. I lost some mustard somewhere inside of here. Right? So what would that look like? Ooh, actually, you know what? I got this. I got this. I got you. Don't worry. Boom. Boom. I, ooh, Hey, look at this. Does this look more like mustard? Oh yeah. I lost well that does not look like mustard hold on hold on sorry i'm losing you guys i'm excited here you go all right so i lost some mustard somewhere in here or i didn't have enough now let's get some let's get some oh, come on i didn't have enough fire in here at a speed that's going to sustain me over time because again if i'm looking at this workout and i'm like okay hey I'm starting, I wanna ramp this bad boy up, I wanna sustain it, and then I, I don't wanna peter down. I wanna be able to sustain this, and then maybe on the nines come back up. So if I was gonna look at this as an energy expenditure, I'm gonna literally come up, come down a little bit, and then try to come up, and then see you guys later. Right, so this is my fastest, hardest, the nines are in here, this is my 21, this is my 15 maintaining and I'm holding the boat afloat. Another great example. This is a 1.5 mile run trying to do it in 10 minutes. So what does that look like? What does my split look like? How does I, how do I get aggressive with it or a 2k seven minute row? That's what it looks like. Cause it's monostructural. Both sides of these are monostructural. The dumbbell, is all about how fast can I move the dumbbell? The burpee is how fast can I move the burpee? And then can I sustain that speed over the course of time? That's really what I'm looking at. That's how I would adjust this. That's how I would address this. And shit, man, I like this new modern setup. I don't know if that works for you guys, but it works for me. And uh, thank you guys for reaching out. Thank you guys for uh, making me do this. Um, that was It was good. It's good. It's been a while. Um, it's then I'm excited for the next one. I'll bring it out. I'll try to do this Thursday. I might even do it live. Who knows? All right, man. Have a good one.